God damn you! No way. Whoa, whoa, now. whoa, hey, no. hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid <laughs> I'll fucking kill you! All right, what's going on? <laughs> what are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. Woody, I'm gonna break your fucking face. Is that a fact? Yeah, that's a fact. You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. You gotta calm down. Had enough? At least it's a fucking challenge. You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Hey, if you can't be nice, I'm gonna make you wait outside. Oh, fucking shit. You bogged my jaw, you bastard. And still you talk. Fuck you. Shit. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry, you saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off! Alright, you need to go. I can't go until this deadbeat pays me. For what? I let you slap me around for a while. You're lucky I'm not charging extra. Why was he hitting you? Maybe you should ask him that. I will, but I asked you first. He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of... Stones! And threw him in the fucking river! That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch! Hey, what did I say about that word? Come on! By all means, take your time. So, uh, how good is your insurance? I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. 
Stay here! No! Hey! Stop! Leave me alone! Same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. What were you doing back there? Had some questions for Larry. Didn't think it'd go how it did. A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Then who did? Look. I was just asking him about the girl, that's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Who are you, exactly? I'm Dee, and I'm a private investigator. There's a business card in my shirt pocket. You can see for yourself. This is for a sandwich shop. Really? Huh. Must have run out. Who hired you? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand. Nope. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Oh, don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No. I'm D. He's dumb. <gasps> hey! Stop! This isn't what I want! Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. Only comes sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? Lapdog? Really? Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. I wouldn't call her that. It's happened before, and it doesn't end well. I didn't realize you were the bitch of the bitch. Come that all you got? Seemed to be enough. 
Don't be so sure. Oh. Chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. Enough. I took care of you! I love- It's not what you think! Please! You're cheating on me! With him?! No! No, Beast! I promise I'm not! I'm helping him, that's all! I'll bet! I'm sure you help each other just great! This is a murder investigation. She's helping me- Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you?! She's my wife! Beast, listen to me! There's nothing going on! I'm mad! Hey! Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! I knew you were sneaking around! I don't want to hurt you, so just calm down and- Beast! What the hell do you think you're doing? You aren't even listening to me! She's my wife, Bigby! I told you! Stop! Please! Leave him be! This is my fault! Hello! <laughs> 
fucking what? Shit, Bigby. What have you done? What? What is this? Bigby. Look what you did to the door! You can't just act like this whenever Stand you- Stand back! You, you don't want to see this. Always wanting to do things the fun way. Ladies, gentlemen, invertebrates, please, rest easy. This is not- What the hell is going on? What's happening? Very sorry to impose, but we only had a deal to work out with Bigby. And we're unhappy to report that things did not go as smoothly as planned. Bigby, what is he talking about? Never you mind that, it ain't any of your- What deal? I'm not making any deal with you. So just get the fuck out of here and leave these people alone. Nah. <laughs> What did I tell you? What did I say? Ali? You think you motherfuckers can come here uninvited? You think you can just fucking interrupt Lily's funeral? Calm down, darling. It was just a simple business transaction. You fucking freaks are not getting away with this. Ali, let me handle this. Yeah, let's spare all the fuss. It's just a dead hole. I'm gonna kill you! <laughs> What you got there? Look, it's recently come under our attention that you're... How shall I put this? Attempting to claim what is the personal property of the Crooked Man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds. Pissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. What do you want? That sack of flour. Crane, dear. It's Crane. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Step aside. Tweedledee. What's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mundies call me? Wha what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh... Bloody, Bloody Ma Mary, that's it. Thank you. And do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. He's in custody, so move your car. I told you he'd never just give him up.
hell. It just didn't know when to end. I mean, hey, look, I know it sounds ridiculous, but really, guys, <laughs> can you argue with these results? Because I know I can't. Wait! Stop! Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Just stop, please. Hmm. Snow, uh, stay out of this. It's your lucky day, kid. The crooked man says it's okay with him. Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomach ache? Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no killer. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. We'll be in touch. See you around. Jersey, don't don't give me that shit. What the fuck is the point of having a system if you're just gonna my fucking Jack. system? What the fuck is going on? But you, I'm uh, the guy who just makes gonna. Sure. I'm the guy that keeps uh, shit in order, you know. and that's it, Woody. If you love your ex so fucking much, why'd you pawn it in the first fucking place, huh? I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was. So get the fuck out of my sight. Hit the bricks. See you later. Hey, what's going on here? What the fucking hell? Christ. And this fucking guy, too? Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. What did you do with it? How the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. You're gonna... <clears throat> you piece of shit. <clears throat> I'm gonna rip your fucking lungs out. <clears throat> Back it up, Jersey. You're dealing with me now. You got here fast. Still looking for whoever killed them hookers? Or are you done chasing your tail? Where's my axe? Who'd you give it to? You follow me here all the way from Battery fucking Park? Hey, back off and settle down. Oh, what the fuck are you gonna do? Back off, dog. I just want what's mine. My axe. You talk big. But I don't think you got the stones to back it up. <laughs> Still a little sore, are we? Why should Mary get all the fun? You ain't so tough. This ain't gonna go like... Ah! You fuck! Oh, motherfucker! Oh. What the hell are you doing? This is my fucking fight. Not now. Dog, you got a lot of nerve. Try to stop. 
Magic Mirror's missing shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? You don't know anything about anything, do you? What do you have? Nothing. Had ah, useless bitch Snow White in a broken fucking mirror. Nothing? I still have you, don't I? You can't find a crooked man. No one can. Oh, the door to his house. It bounces around, never in one spot. You'll never find it. Even Crane had to use the magic mirror. They dumped all his shit here. Bloody Mary uses this place like a fucking dump. Where's Crane's stuff? Where'd they put it? In back. Just go on. Get Crane's shit and go. Not that it's gonna do you any good. See anything? Crane's coat. No time for traveler's checks, huh? That sick piece of... The shard. It's the shard. Finally. Hey, Sheriff. Those girls are still dead. Oh, and there's nothing you can do to bring them back. And I don't know what they did, but I do know this. Oh, if they're dead, it's because the crooked man wanted them dead. That's all it takes. So you can roar, smash the place up. <laughs> Shit. You can wail on me all you want. But what good is it gonna do you? Cause he ain't in your town. You're in his. And he sure as shit is ready for you. Out of smoke? having trouble deciding which one of you to hit with this thing. Jersey was wrong, you know. About what? 
about those girls. There is something you can do about it. You can get the fucker who did it. Ain't that the plan? Yeah, you're damn right it is. All right, go do it then. Hey, Woody. Yeah? What are you gonna do now? We all got our roles to play, Wolf. I'll see ya. You must be tired. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Please, Sheriff, relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. I'm here for one reason. And it's not to eat your fucking food. Really? Yeah. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna... Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You know why I'm here. You killed those women. What women? Faith and Lily. The girls who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Did I now? I assume by your confidence in accusing me, you must have some proof of this, yes? Some allotment of evidence. A witness, perhaps. Your servant over there told me you did it. That's a fucking lie! I didn't say anything like it's that! fine. All I said was that this was your town, and nothing wouldn't happen without your approval, all right? That's it. If only that were true. Those women, I don't relish telling you that the killings were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you, and to assure you that it's over with. I already know who did it. Forgive me, Sheriff, for doubting your acumen, but who do you think committed these crimes? I hope you don't still think I did it. Don't give me this employee bullshit. I know it was you. <laughs> what must I say to convince you that I'm innocent, dear? It wasn't me. I have complete respect for you and your job, I really do, but I'm sorry. I simply can't divulge the transgressor. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? The man said he'd take care of it. I'm already pissed off. You don't want to make it worse. Oh, I think I do. I'd love a good reason to put a bullet between your eyes after what you did! That's enough! I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but in the interest of preserving our alliance, if you have to know, it was Georgie. However, like I said, I'll be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie. You got what you wanted, so just... Sit. Down. Now. Yeah, I killed him, so what? Why'd you do it? Why kill them? Does it matter? Look, the fact is... George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So... Let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. That you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this! And then you attempt told me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will be silent. 
while we discuss what to do with you. This is right bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this? So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. I think I'll be taking both of you. You're not taking me, you fucking ponce. What the fuck is this shit? You said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I give a fuck if I'm the one who... Who the shit do you think you fuckers are? Get the fuck out of here! I do apologize, Sheriff, but I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him! Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit, but he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? You're gonna make sure we all go down this shitter with you? I already told you. I'm taking both of you in, so let's go. This could have gone so well. To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you, all fixed up. Over here! You're done, Wolf! Come on, we're pretty much done here. I'd like to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad to see your insides turned out. some business to attend to. I leave you in the capable hands of my associate. Come find me when you finish, dear. Don't worry. This won't take long. Get out of my way now. Don't make this worse. Aw, he doesn't want to play. I'm sure you'll persuade him. <laughs> Cut this shit out! Didn't your mother ever teach you manners? Or was she too busy fucking whatever breeze drifted through town? Come on! Is that the best you can do?
Come out and face me! He's guilty. Good enough for me? Me too. 
So that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Nah, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves! You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You're done talking, crooked man. You had your chance. Well done, then. Now, for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I not good you. enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't Hasn't stopped. I don't care. So, so we get rid of him. To get him so out of here. We can send him Everyone, away. Everyone, listen up! Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment, so I think this we- This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? We should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. That makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are you sure? This isn't how it's- It's what the people want, Miss White. Okay. Mr. Wolf, it's your call. Snow. Just do what you think is right. Yes, Sheriff. Do what you think is right. Everyone, I'm- Not this way! There you are. I hope you all remember this moment. Think of me when you try to sleep. Finish it, Sheriff. Please, we can still- End it already. You're going to miss me. No, I won't. For Lily, and Faith. Yes, another one of us to erase from the books. <laughs> <laughs>